Since dinosaurs evolved into people, man has had one question. Will Montel Williams endorse Kamala Harris for president since they used to knock boots back in the day? And now we have the answer, sort of. So as soon as Biden dropped out, Montel Williams, who famously once dated Kamala Harris back in the day, did not immediately come out and say, she should be the front runner for the Democrats. Instead, he threw support behind the governor of Maryland, Wes Moore. And then afterward, people noticed like, well, why aren't you backing Kamala Harris? Because she's clearly the front runner now. But now Montel might have changed his tune because he then retweeted Wes Moore's endorsement of Kamala. So he's basically saying, if Wes Moore is behind Kamala, then I'm behind. But he's not explicitly saying that. It's not a glowing endorsement of her by any means. Did they have a bad breakup? He sounds a little salty. And he's like, yeah, I'll vote for her. She gives me my sweatshirt back. <laughs> <laughs> well, in the meantime, other celebrities are weighing in on on Kamala, like Cardi B, who pointed out that back in June, she said, I feel like it's very selfish that they um, allow Biden to continue to run for president. I feel like they should have passed the torch to, Kama to Kamala. In any case, there's only one thing we know for sure about the 2024 election. This is going to be really interesting. People are excited again. Pantsuit Nation is back in action after 2016. Pantsuit Nation? <laughs> Pantsuit Nation started when Hillary Clinton was running. Pantsuit Nation is a place I want to be nowhere near. <laughs> so thanks, Montel Williams. A lady you used to bang may be our next president.